Hello Disney Pixar Cars Collectors. Welcome back to another Collectors Hangout presentation. I hope that everyone watching this video is having lots of success finding the latest castings. You'll find the latest releases at the largest department stores, but don't forget that your local independent stores sometimes get some of these newer releases. Sometimes you'll find the unexpected just by thinking outside of the box. If you're tuning into the Collector's Hangout for the first time, we'd like to welcome you and thank you for tuning in. If you have any questions, please feel free to use the comments box below. Here's what else you can expect to find in this case assortment. You'll find one Dynaco helicopter, one Brian Fuel, two Reds, and two tractors. These castings are for the first time appearing at Target department stores and I personally found these on Saturday March 28th 2015. If you have found these elsewhere on or around the same time let us know in the comments below. They don't necessarily pop up in the same store but for me I found these for the first time in Target. The first casting that we're going to talk about in this video is Brian Fuel. He's number two of seven in the Ye Left Turn series. Here's the back of the package and to start off with I'm going to read to you the little synopsis right over here in the top right hand corner about what this series is all about. So it says, at Ye Left Turn N in London you never know who you'll come across crashing through the front door. Now we'll talk about this little synopsis over here in just a few seconds but first let me show you what else is available for 2015. In this video we're going to talk about Brian Fuel and Chauncey Ferris is due to be released later on in this year as a single. Now that was originally available at Target as an exclusive, well I'll call it a timed exclusive, in a box set. So now you'll be able to receive him alone in a single pack just for yourself. So you don't have to buy the entire pack, you may still see those uh, box sets at Target. Quite frankly, my, my honest opinion. I used to buy them because I thought they were exclusive when I was a little bit more naive in collecting and I was still new. But you know what? If I see those box sets, I leave them alone. I just, hey, great for the guy that's buying a gift for somebody for their birthday party or if you like box sets, great. But I would rather wait and buy the single casting in a single package alone. So here's Brian Fuel out of the package. Let's take a quick look at what he looks like. We'll talk a little bit about what, how, where he appears in the movie. And one thing to mention is that he's pretty heavy. Solid die cast here. The only thing that's plastic on this particular casting is probably here the windows, wheels, and the front forklift. The only time in the movie when you see Brian Fuel is when Grimm and Acer get knocked off the road by flying Holly Schiffwell right around the one hour and 30 minute mark of the movie. The two lemons end up in Ye Left Turn Bar and that's the only time when you see Brian Fuel for like a quick millisecond if, you, if you're quick enough to see him that is. And this is what that little scene looks like in the movie. Now since he's not a major character in the movie and I wouldn't even consider him a minor character. He's, I mean, I, I would never know that he exists in the movie if it weren't for this casting being released. He has just not shown enough for you to know his existence. But either way, it's cool to have as part of the collection. And if you are able to describe where in the movie he exists, then that makes him a great addition to your collection. So, this is Brian Fuel. Be sure to get him and add him to your collection. The next casting in this assortment that we're going to speak about is Tractor. And I would assume that most fans of the series have not found this particular casting yet. If you haven't, like myself, now is your chance to get your hands on this and add it to your collection. Now here's what the Radiator Spring synopsis says back here. And it says, Lightning McQueen slows down to enjoy small town Radiator Springs before heading to the Piston Cup tiebreaker race. Here's what else you can expect to find in 2015 for the Deluxe series and the regular Mainline series. 
first we'll see red here which is already included in this particular assortment frank you saw released in the previous case here we have mater he's always released year after year so you can always expect to see him and here we have tractor which we'll talk about in this video yellow ramon former toys r us exclusive and sheriff which you'll also see release year after year as well so this is what you could expect to see later on this year and there are 19 in the radiator spring series so look out for the rest coming out throughout the year so here we have tractor out of the package and this is considered to be the first regular release of tractor as a single in the deluxe series and technically he was originally released as part of the storyteller series during that release he was only available in minimum quantities or limited quantities apart from that this casting was also available in a movie moment pack alongside Luigi and Guido so this is a bit very basic casting nothing more to tell about this he's from the cars one movie and you all remember seeing these when Mater and Lightning McQueen go tractor tipping and they scare the the tractors and they kind of flip over just like that so that's that's basically it I mean they even look like I mean you see the little spots here they're made to resemble cows I guess I mean tractor tipping is sort of similar to like cow tipping and some of you may know what cow tipping is is when you go out in the middle of the night into a cornfield where the cow are sleeping and they think they sleep standing up and you can literally just push them and they fall over so that's that's pretty much what cow tipping is and I guess it relates directly to tractor tipping and Mater and Lightning McQueen were out having some fun that night and then they got chased out by Frank <laughs> so I mean that just has a little character to the movie a little fun so this is Tractor. Be sure to get this in the tea case. Let me know if you have the original release. Put that in the comments below. So those are the two most important releases in this case assortment. The other castings included in this assortment have already been released several times between 2013 and 2014 and now in 2015. But if you are new to collecting, be sure to get these before somebody else does. You know, I'll never forget a little time before I started collecting these wonderful characters or at least getting serious about acquiring each one and adding them to my collection. I thought to myself that they would always be on the shelf, that there would be plenty of stock to go around. I soon learned my lesson when I came back to try and buy them that there were other collectors in the area and they were looking just as hard and supply wasn't really abundant. So if you're out there looking and you have my previous thoughts please think otherwise simply because releases of these collectible toys aren't consistent enough you don't want to kick yourself later because you decided not to buy one so here at the collectors hangout we say leave no casting behind bye for now thanks again for tuning in to this edition of the collectors hangout don't forget to like this video and share it with your other collector friends. The two video boxes shown here contain other viewable videos by the Collector's Hangout. So if you click on the video to the left, you'll be able to watch the 2015 Deluxe Case R featuring Frank. The video to the right has a video presentation for the 2014 Deluxe Case K featuring Ivan. If you are watching this video on a tablet, phone, or other multimedia device, you may not be able to click on those video boxes. However, if you look at the description box below, you'll be able to click on those links and watch the videos shown here.